Well, hello again. I'm Phil Horlock, President and CEO of Bluebird Corporation. And I'm pleased to be joined again by my good friend, X-Men. In a moment or two, X-Men and I are gonna jump on this bus and give you a little taste of what it's all about. This is our best-selling Bluebird Vision Bus, and it's powered by an alternative fuel. Why don't you tell us a bit more about this bus, X-Men? Yes, good morning. This is our Vision School Bus, which has a Ford engine and transmission. It has a 7.3 liter engine, as well as 350 horsepower. So it has plenty of power, and you'll be amazed when we take you on the ride this morning. We'll see you then. All right, Phil, we're ready for the propane. We're gonna give it a test drive, the 7.3 liter Ford engine. Cool, let's do it. I'll fire it up and give it a shot. Then go to the test, testing site. That's awesome. Like I mentioned earlier, this particular engine has 350 horsepower. That's quite, that, when you think about that, I mean, that diesel we drove, like 220. Yes, it's it 350. is. 350. It's, it's quite a difference. You know, first thing I noticed, though, I've got to tell you, is the quietness. It's unbelievable. Yes, it is absolutely quiet. I mean, this is no, no more, no louder than, say, the, uh, the SUV I drive, right? With a gas, with a full gas engine. Yes, it's it about is. the same. About the same. You know what's cool about this engine? The 73. It's a brand new engine that Ford produces and it goes in their class-leading, best-selling F-250. And we are the only manufacturer of any automotive company that uses it other than Ford. Isn't that cool? That is nice. Especially with the six-speed transmission it has, the Ford six-speed transmission, it has plenty of power here. Yep. And it sounds great. You know, what's important about that too is that transmission was built and designed completely and entirely to work with this engine. So it's matched to it. It's not like a, that transmission works with every other engine around. It was designed and calibrated just to work with this, to pair with it. That's why it works so well together. It's shifted, it's six speed transmission, shifted smoothly. Awesome power. How's it now? What's your first impression versus diesel engines that we've all used for years? When you drive this and you take off and like you're doing now, what's your first impression? The first thing is I noticed is the, 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 the pickup speed, the torque that it has, and it is extremely quiet, uh, not a lot of excessive noise, uh, and you can actually hear the, the, the horsepower in the, in the motor when you press down on the gas. So it's a smooth ride. You know, you mentioned the torque. I think a lot of people are often surprised uh, when they first try propane. I think they think, because it's propane, well, it's not going to be as powerful as a diesel engine. Then you tell them it's 350 horsepower. Absolutely. And you remind them it's in those F-250s that are doing construction jobs every day. You know, and, and that's what you see in now, the pickup. Because I know I've, I've tested one previously, I've tested the older generation. This is even superior to it. But uh, you know, that pickup acceleration is quite amazing. It's just like these lines. First gear, nice and smooth. Yep. Actually, the engine's got a really nice tone to it, hasn't it? Yes, it does. You know, we like to use the phrase when we talk about this engine, the three words that come to mind, which we've been advertising. And our head of marketing there, Justine Labello, she, she, she picked this phrase. We call it leaner, meaner, and cleaner. All right. Because leaner, cool. leaner is, it's, more, it's, a, it's, a, it's a bigger engine. It's a 7.3 with yes. less than 6.8. It's actually more compact. So when you open the hood to work on the engine, Serviceability is really easy. You can get around an engine with effortlessly. I know for a fact competitors' engines, they disappear under the cowl. You can't even get to points of that engine. Not with a Bluebird engine. Not with a Bluebird with this engine in it. Second thing is, it's got more horsepower than the other end. Other yes, it does. And you can feel it. You can feel it. It's more horsepower. It's actually got better fuel economy. It's got more torque. And then when you look at it, you know, you compare it again with diesel, we offer two emissions levels on this. Nitrous oxide levels, we call it NOx. So I told you earlier, the diesel is 0.2 NOx, right? Right. This comes in 0.05 wow. and 0.02. That is awesome. Now at 0.02, you are 90% cleaner than the emissions connected to the diesel engine. 
and that's called ultra low emissions. It's the next thing to zero. So I'm really proud of that fact that we were able to do this, you know, bring it to the to the school in school bus industry. You know how many of these things we sell every year now? Propane? How many to you? Yeah, so about one almost one third of every school buses we sell are now propane powered. That That's amazing. amazing. That amazing. And we have an over we have almost 80% market share in propane powered school buses. Wow. I know all these facts because I talk a lot to, to customers and you know and track all this stuff, but what I like is the when you look at what we call owner loyalty. And we measure over a period of five years, the customer switch and they stay with us. This has the highest order loyalty of any product on the market. So in other words, once you get, once you buy propane, they stick right. with propane. They stick with it. Absolutely. And you know why we like low emissions, low, ultra low emissions? You know why? Why is that? Because yeah. we care about kids. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. You know, we call it the bluebird difference. Uh, we want to be different. We like being different. And uh, what I'm really proud of this is, is that we've had a relationship with Ford Motor Company does the engine. Right. And Roush Clean Tech is a fantastic engineering company, does the fuel system for us. And we have an exclusive with those guys. We're the only company that Ford Motor Company has an exclusive deal with. In other words, they won't sell that to anybody else in the school bus market. Isn't that cool? Wow, that is cool. And so what they've done is they've tailored it again, as Roush has, just for us. That's why it works so well in a Bluebird bus. We made it to the test strip again, Phil. That's right. I'm getting a little nervous now, getting ready. 350 horsepower. Yes, it is. For a beginner. All right, we made it. Okay. All right, Phil, we'll get you all strapped in your seatbelt and get you set to go. On the propane vision, what I've done this time is decided to leave it running because I have like a 10 to 15 second delay. Okay. You know what the delay is for? You know what's going on there? You yes. probably know better than I do, right? Yes, it does a system check to make sure uh, everything is ready to go. Yeah, what's cool What's cool about a propane, and this is, this is actually, I think it's pretty unique with Roush's, for safety reasons, when you turn this off, all that fuel, that propane fuel is in the engine. It sucks it all back into the fuel tank. So it has to recharge it again, so that's that little delay. That is awesome. It's all about safety. All about safety. You know why? Because we care about our kids. That's right, that's right. Absolutely. Okay, let's take that break off. Let's get right. it going. Let's give it a we'll shot. Give it a shot. I tell you, again, first thing I know is idling. Here we are idling. I actually didn't know the engine was even running. I mean, you sit here right. and you feel like, wow, is this really going? Is that just, is that just the air brakes I'm hearing or something? But no, it's actually, it is, it is going. Look at it. Right. Oh my gosh. There's a completely different. Now, come on, my experience here. I mean, just ridden that diesel completely different experience driving this. First of all, you don't have the quietness I mentioned earlier, but the pickup is completely different. It's just, this is absolutely like driving, say a Ford Explorer, yes, Lincoln Navigator. It really is. Obviously like, just like driving an F-250, of course, because it's using the F-250. But this is, uh, this is really amazing, this gas engine. When you accelerate, notice the 350. Yes. Yep. And of course, this is propane power. It's not gas. Although we use a gas engine block, that's where it ends. Everything else, the fuel system, all designed one purpose only, to run on propane, um, which is super clean fuel, as we talked about earlier. Obviously, same characteristics as our diesel in terms of the way we build this bus. Colorado racking standard, Altoona testing standard, that good old Kentucky pole test. Right, that's the standard. I know our marketing team, you know, Justine wanted me to drop a ball, a kind of tacky ball on top of this later on. I said, <laughs> it's just a little too costly, you know. Let's give it some. Man, yeah, that's oh, speed. Yeah, I tell you, I'm stuff. at the end of the track already. <laughs> that's, that is completely yeah, different. Great job. Great yeah. job. Yeah. yeah. Let's try through those cones. I'm sure it's just as. Obviously, just as maneuverable as any Bluebird bus is. Yes, it is. So we pride ourselves. And actually, you really feel the impact of our turning radius here. Yeah, like I said, tightest turning radius in the market on every bus we produce. And you feel it, you're just making that little mm -hmm. turn to go into the cones and 
and straighten out really nice. So besides, so, so here's what propane's got going for it. You know, I talked about emissions. Yes. Ultra low NOx emissions. Yes. And what does NOx do? It causes asthma in children. It can actually lead to cancer, unfortunately. You know, you see those old diesel buses with a big black plume at the exhaust pipe? Mm -hmm. Those days are gone with a bus like this. They never happen. Wow. This engine is durable, it's tough, and like I say, it's about one tenth of the emission standard of today's cleanest diesel. And if you live in California, in most cases that qualify for special grants and funding. But here's the beauty of propane, to buy propane buses, even though it's an alternative fuel power bus, it's the only alternative fuel power bus that does not need a grant to make it financially attractive. In that fact, it's the lowest cost of ownership of any school bus on the planet. And I don't just mean in school buses, literally on the planet. And what I mean by that is, when you look at what you save when you buy this versus a diesel, you think about it, it uses half the oil of a diesel engine. So in terms of service costs, lower. Air filters, oil filters, very inexpensive versus diesel. No, no turbocharger. Wow. Not that that's a serviceable item on a diesel engine. No turbocharger. No regeneration. That's the one really negative, I think, of diesel is that regeneration you've got to keep doing. You know, and often school bus speeds don't get up to the point where it automatically regenerates it during the journey, so they've got to do it offline. No need for that. And that of course, awesome. then, then you get down to fuel. How much do you pay for your diesel per gallon, roughly? Wow, that's about $2.75. 275 You know what propane costs? How average, much? average across the country? How much? A dollar and five cents a gallon. Wow. Tremendous savings. In fact, there are some states, they've been as low as this past year, 57 cents a gallon. Wow. And you know the federal government gives you a 50 cents a gallon rebate to the customer. That is amazing. So they're buying it for seven cents. So even without that, even without the saving of that rebate, when you look at what you save in fuel, all those maintenance costs, mm -hmm. you're gonna save between three to $4,000 a year, depending on how many miles you do. So let's say you do 12,000 miles a year. You're gonna save over 3,000. Now you run that bus for 15 years. Right. 15 times three is 45,000. A little bit more than that. You're gonna save about $50,000 over 15 years. That's half the price of the bus. Yes, it is. Now imagine you have a fleet of 100 school buses and they're all propane. And you just change over from diesel. Over 15 years, you've just saved $5 million for that school district. Wow. And that's a lot of buses you can buy or you can put it back in the classroom for the kids, right? Yes, you can. And that's the exciting thing about propane. It's ultra low emissions. It's the cleanest on the road, other than obviously electric, which is zero, but it's the most affordable. And I don't, I don't understand how people, and I've seen this, they'll come to our plant. Oh, I mean, I've been working diesel for 30 years. I don't want to try that newfangled propane. Well, hang on, we've been doing it now for more than 10 years. We have over 20,000 propane powered school buses on the road. More than 20,000. Wow. That's the best. That's mind blowing. That's over five times more than all of our competitors combined. You know what you call that? Wow. Leadership. Leadership. <laughs> yeah, the case but we're proud leadership. of that. We're proud of that. We, we, we like giving people choices. We give you diesel, we give you propane. We give you gasoline and we offer you electric. That's right. And we have the broadest range in the industry. But for me, I always say, people say to me, what's the best bus today, today, to offer to our school bus operators, be it school district fleets? I said, without question, it's propane. Right. Because it's clean and it's the lowest cost to operate, as I mentioned earlier, fantastic savings. So it's a terrific bus. And then we think about, if people say to me, well, how do I fuel it? You can put an, an above ground propane fuel Take. tank for about $25,000 and install it right there in your schoolyard. And in fact, most, most of the propane providers who provide you with the fuel, if you do a three year contract and you say you've got five buses in your fleet, right. they'll, 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 do the, they'll, they'll install that station, fuel station for nothing. Wow. You can't win, you can't yeah, lose, you right? Can't lose. Can't, lose. can't lose. It's a winner all around. I gotta tell you, 
just take a little pause right now. I really like this engine. I really like this product. Like I said, it's quiet. It's much more akin to driving a regular vehicle on the road. The pickup is amazing. Uh, the tone of the engine is really, a, it's actually attractive. I, I still like the sound of a combustion engine, right? I just can't help it. But there's something about this. The tone is really pleasant. And uh, here we are idling again. Yeah, straight and you wouldn't, you wouldn't even think the engine's going, would you? Absolutely. That's quiet. Now, that's a good and a bad thing, right? Because the driver can now hear everything the kids are saying on the bus. <laughs> <laughs> Well, like I said before, drivers love it. And I've talked, I've been to many of these uh, rodeos in different states, particularly in Georgia. And I'll talk to drivers and, and those who've driven properly they say, I never want to drive anything else in my property. Right. It's quiet, it's clean, hey the kids, it's a pleasure to drive. That's, that's what you want to hear, huh? That's right, absolutely. Yep. I, say, I must say, you passed the test again. I'll tell you. Nice driving. I'm CD now, I've just got L to go. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's nice. Next time on Pit Grand Tour. And in a moment or two, we're going to jump on this really cool Bluebird All-American school bus. One of the best buses we've ever built. This is our all-new zero-emission electric school bus. It is extremely quiet. It has plenty of power. <laughs> I won't be needing these. The engine is <laughs> actually go. running. There you go. We are all set. That is amazing, isn't it? We have amazing acceleration here. It's a nice pickup and keep up with the flow of traffic without any delays. Is that quiet a lot? I mean, this is what I love about it. Like I said, zero emissions, super quiet. Every day I get in the queue. Get on the bus and drive with you. I love it. See? School bus karaoke. That's, you can yeah. only do that on an electric bus. <laughs>